and here comes the start of the clock and e4 so no surprise there Anand started the game by the king pawn move and e5 as I expected <laughs> so so far we're repeating what happened in game 4 knight, knight f3. f3 so far everything is repeating exactly knight c6 and now comes the question if uh, Anand will play the Rui Lopez yeah, and he does, does. Bishop to b5, here we are. And uh, now is the question if, okay. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> guess it right. I did guess it right this time. It's the Berlin, but, but. It, here comes the difference. <laughs> and that doesn't surprise me because playing that Berlin end, end game, mm -hmm. uh, the world top players have been trying to break that wall unsuccessfully. Yeah. And the king went to f3. So now if it was Black's turn, Black would move the rook to the e-file. So therefore yet another check is coming. So where is he hiding from the checks? King f4. Now the pawn is threatening to promote, so the rook will come down to the first rank. Oh. The typical idea of trying to deflect the rook certainly doesn't work right away. He didn't go down. He went up all the way to a8 to use the idea of the skewer. So if now black promotes the pawn to a queen, then so let's show that to our viewers. If the pawn promotes to a queen, then the rook checks and then wins the newly born queen. However, instead one option that black has to promote the pawn to a knight mm -hmm. and that would be with a check and then of course black wouldn't have the time to give that check with the rook because white would be in check himself so the king would be forced to move out of the check and that feels like probably a win for black mm -hmm. and no he has a different idea rook g1 simply what was happening and it's to game over, one? and it's game over, Anand just resigned. What was the idea after rook a1? We hear a very happy Norwegian team. Of course, for them, it's definitely celebration day. Anand is uh, quite disappointed. I think this is okay. the first time that they've earned exchanging at least a few words after the game. Magnus, maybe you can start also today. Um, yeah, I thought I, I got a pretty solid position out of the opening. Um, then at some point, um, well, I was a little bit better, but nothing much going on. And uh, he either sacrificed or blundered a pawn. Um, after that, I got a very good rook ending, but I'm, I'm not at all sure if it's winning. Um, then at this point, I, I miss the whole I, h5 idea. I, I didn't really um, think you could give up a pawn like that, but obviously then it's, um, then it's good. Maybe I, I can try h5 and then uh, try and, and press for a win eventually. <laughs> 